Hey everybody, I'm so excited to be back out on the road for Country Lines Magazine. Oh my gosh, you guys, I get to drive this vehicle today. I know, I don't even know what they were thinking. They said, hey Crystal, take the keys, right? <laughs> Rachel Johnson, tell me about this Mustang. I mean, can you tell me at least a little bit about how it charges? People are just used to a gas station on every yeah. corner, so they worry that they might not be able to have a charge when they yeah. need one. Uh, you know, the range of this vehicle is over 250 miles. Wow. So for most people, anywhere you're gonna go, you can get there and back to your home. But if you're out and you need to charge, there is so much more public charging infrastructure in Northern Michigan than people think. Yeah. Where you'll charge today is more than likely gonna be a charge point charger. Oh, uh, no. And they have their own app. When you open the app, it'll show you all the chargers around you. So I'm not going to be stranded. You are not. We would. Not, I would never <laughs> let that happen to you, Crystal. How long does it take to charge a vehicle like this? So for a lot of people, whether it's at their home or at a hotel overnight, yeah. they, they're going to be plugged in for seven to eight hours. So they don't won't necessarily need to put a fast charge in. Yeah. It just lets the, ch the, the car charge over time. But the, the fastest you would charge this car is probably about 30 minutes. And there are fast chargers as well. Wow. All over Michigan. 30 minutes. Yeah. And that's <laughs> going to get faster. The Ford has really put together a, a great uh, combination of a sports car and luxury car when it comes to the Mach-E. The all-wheel drive horsepower is about 450 horsepower um, zero to 60 in about three and a half seconds could we call it robot horsepower because it's electric we could yeah <laughs> i guess horsepower isn't the word but that's the technology yeah. the terminology that they use so it, it's very very fast and Ooh. it's um, the response is, is automatic because it's electric um, so it seems like it's even a little bit faster um, can it beat the tesla uh, uh, this is being recorded so i'm not gonna uh, <laughs> divulge if i've raced it at all so okay so i just push power that's it. Wait, it's on? It's not on. It's too too quiet. 15 and a half inch touchscreen, all digital. Um, Ooh. You, you do everything from here. This is unbelievable. It is like driving a computer. Messing with the radio or something. Somebody stopped in front of you. Big red warning sign will come up on your dash and automatically stop the car for you. Whoa. Wow, this is a safe car. Anything else? Do you trust me to drive it? Well, you signed the consent form, so. <laughs> there you, you go. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. You're welcome. <laughs> and here we go. We're going to the Amber Elk Ranch in Ludington. It's 65 miles away, and we're going to make it with so much charge left. It's, it's amazing. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay. Oh, my gosh. It is fast. Oh yeah, oh, feel the power and no transmission. Oh my gosh, this thing is so fast. Like I'm barely pressing the gas pedal right now. Oh, it's not even a gas pedal. <laughs> what do I call it? Oh, the accelerator. It's an accelerator. We're gonna use real terms now. <laughs> this is a VJ. All right, guys, we're here at the Amber Elk Ranch, and this is just before we get into Ludington. It's fantastic in a little village called Amber. Oh, they're making the cutest little noises. Hi, baby. Oh my goodness, are you a good boy? Yeah. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> what is it called on the outside of the uh, actual antler? Is that velvet? There's probably a scientific term. <laughs> That's okay. He's my velvet brother. Oh, hello, are you the sweetest? Hello. Elk burgers, corn on the cob. We're gonna have some mushrooms and some cheese on it. Let's be honest, this is why I'm really here. <laughs> We're eating elk burgers. This has pepper jack cheese and mushrooms on it. And then also, they boil the corn in the husk. It's so much easier. My life has changed forever. Mm. Oh, that is good. 
That is really good. Well, now that we've taken the Mustang to see some elk, let's take her out to see some water. We'll go to Ludington's Waterfront Park next. I'm so quiet, you didn't even hear me coming. All right, let's go check out the waterfront and all the sculptures and just have a great time in the sunshine in Ludington. <laughs> the Morton Salt Company freighter Craigmere began shipping salt primarily to Chicago in 1921. Look, it's Morton Salt. Okay, so apparently this baby has park assist. I'm gonna use it right now, just punch it in. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh my gosh, it's happening, it's happening. Oh my gosh, it's happening. Oh, I'm a Jetson. Here. Look at these cute guys. It's a cool little store. I could get lost in here. <laughs> no problem. Come a cactus? Yeah, ready? Let's see, where do we go next? Going into Kilwins for a little sweet treat. Ooh, choices, choices. What do we get? Ooh, Ludington mud. Is there a lot of mud in Ludington? Oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> mm -mm. Mm. Yep. Urban Oasis, garden center in the middle of the town. Hey everybody, we are making our way to Great Lakes Energy in Scottville and we're gonna be uh, juicing up this bad boy. Yeah, we're gonna plug her in and you know, charge, I guess. <laughs> we have three kinds of charging, level one, level two, level three. This is a level three charger, or also known as a DC quick charger. And this can charge a car in less than an hour. You uh, have to download the app, the yeah. ChargePoint app, put the phone up against here. Authorizing. What? Okay, so plug in. So if I were, you know, doing this just at my house, right, charging up my, you know, my car, I would probably use the level two, level right? Level two or level one. Or level one. Most people go with the level two. Okay. Because all it requires is a 240 volt plug right. in your garage, which is the same thing you would have for your range or your electric dryer. Oh, right, yeah. So we're all juiced up. Time to head back to Traverse City. Come on. Oh, it's on and I didn't even notice. <laughs> Well guys, this has been another amazing road trip and adventure and it's time for this little Mustang to go back to bed. How about that? Me too. What a day. Fantastic times in Ludington today. We had such a great time at the Amber Elk Ranch and you know what? It's just a, it's just a, an amazing day. Thank you so much Michigan Country Lines. We'll be back for another road trip and adventure real soon. Until then, see you later.